Every year we make a trip to the Panhandle for a conference which we enjoy attending. And for the last several years since starting our YouTube channel, we have dedicated a few days of this trip to exploring various cities and the Panhandle and doing the top five best things to do in those cities to create a video that will rank well in search. At this point, however, we've done all the things. So on this trip, we decided to take the pace down a few notches. We decided to go back and just do a few things in the area that we really enjoy doing together as a family. So for this trip, we stopped by Destin, Pensacola, and Foley, Alabama to do a few family favorites. And the first stop on our list was the Gulfarium on Okaloosa Island. So when we arrived, we missed the final dolphin show of the day, but there's a sea lion show in just a little bit, so we'll check that out. Pierce was just a tiny little baby the last time that we came here. Literally, he was like four weeks old. So he is having a great time running around looking at all the different sea animals. See fishies? Swim in water? So we've already seen some sharks and some fish and now Vivian has found the penguins. And these penguins are from South Africa. So they can handle the heat. Oh, now we're darting back to the other side. One of the best parts about this aquarium is that it's right on the beach, so you get some really great views while you're walking through. We found a touch tank. Vivian loves touching stuff, so here we are. We enjoyed the seal show and got to see them do lots of tricks and learn lots of interesting facts about seals. And now we're back over at the touch tank. Finally got them to move from the touch tank to the reptile sanctuary, so we're making some progress. Heading off to the boardwalk area where there are lots more animals for us to explore before they close for the day. We found some stairs, so of course we have to climb those. Mommy, come on. Come on, Mommy. And these lead to the lookout. And of course, it's not quite a Florida marine life park without crocodiles and alligators. Tortoise and a turtle are they, is? Are they snapping turtles? No, 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 they're, no they're not. It's the albino American alligator behind us. I don't know how well you can see those on camera, but there are little baby alligators in there. Now this section out here is I think where the dolphin show was going on earlier because there's a big stadium here and we could see it from the parking lot. It's called the Oasis Encounter and I think it's new since we were here the last time. There are some dolphins out there and they keep surfacing above the water in exactly the same spot each time, but I can't time it just right and capture it on camera. It looks like there's a glass pane on the other side where we can see them from under the water. So we're going to go around there and check that out. See if it's all that our hopes and dreams consist of. Let me show you these. These dolphins are so cute. I mean, like, look at that. Bye, Bye, <laughs> there he goes. We found a gopher tortoise and a Chinese alligator. 
All right, Vivian is demanding that we head back to the touch tank. There are some other animals, but uh, we're just gonna go over and do the touch tank for a little while, because that's her favorite. Pierce wanted to come back and see the sea lions again. Over here near the touch tank is the white pelican exhibit. Seems like they're ready to call it a day. All right, it's almost time for us to go get dinner, but there's one last thing that we haven't seen yet. There's a pretty spectacular aquarium in here. For dinner, we crossed the bridge from Okaloosa Island over to Destin, and we're heading over to the Harbor Walk Village to see if we can find something over here that's kind of quick and maybe inexpensive. Fingers crossed. There's a whole row of food trucks here, so that's pretty cool. You can get a turkey leg for $14. Some of the other ones might be a little more reasonable than that. There's a grilled cheese sandwich place. So we ate at the fry guy truck and we got all manner of fried things. I got the fried popcorn shrimp with the Cajun fries and Vivian got the popcorn shrimp with the cheese fries and Elena got the fried chicken with the nacho fries. And now we've headed over to Destin Commons to spend a little time at the play area over here if it still exists. Um, until we're ready to go and there's one last place we always have to stop when we swing by Destin. Okay. All right, is this boat so much fun? And for our last stop. My favorite. <laughs> so we just got to our room in Pensacola. We're staying at a Holiday Inn here. And uh, when we arrived, the toilet is broken. Like so it's just running and running. And then this isn't supposed to do this. So let's see if we can fix it. Oh no, we can't. Totally broken actually, that broke off. So I went down to the front desk and I told them about it and she said, well, actually all the rooms are sold out and I don't have any maintenance people on shift tonight. So the earliest they can look at it is tomorrow morning. So it is what it is, I guess. It'll just run this evening. At least it's not overflowing. But also I had to go down to the front desk because I was gonna use the phone, but this phone is connected to nothing. <laughs> it's just a phone and I dropped the receiver on the floor. And I checked back behind here and there's no phone cord. All right, they bought us the phone cord, but still tomorrow for the repair. This morning, we headed over to the Pensacola Children's Museum and we spent some time exploring there for a little while. This section's pretty neat. You can have uh, different outfits for the dolls. They're magnetic. It's so cool. Pierce likes the wheelbarrow. He likes putting stuff in it and then pushing it around. That's a red pepper. We're gonna explore upstairs now. First stop is the grocery store. He wants me to ride in the children's ambulance, so here I am. He's not a very good driver. <laughs> Where are you going? And then it was off to our favorite Chinese buffet in Pensacola, Chow Time. I got some shrimp, spaghetti, and chips. 
We really like all the wide variety of Chinese food that they have there and I got the broccoli beef and the broccoli chicken. So when we got back to our hotel room this afternoon, they had gotten the toilet fixed and everything was ready to go. And also I didn't mention that they gave us complimentary breakfast as an apology for the inconvenience of the toilet situation. Yeah. And now for the next couple of days, we're gonna settle into the conference that we came here for. So we'll pick up on the other side. After the conference concluded, we decided to take an evening to head over the Florida state line to Foley, Alabama to eat at Lambert's Cafe, the home of the Throwed Rolls. There are three of these in the entire United States. Two of them are located in Missouri, and one of them is located right here on the Gulf Coast in Alabama. There is a fine selection of home-style meals along with several premium sides, but the best part are the all-you-can-eat Throwed Rolls, Yay! Here, buddy. Catch it. Put your hands. Got it. Yay! Yay! Which tastes even better with apple butter and molasses. Would you like some apple butter? <laughs> there are, of course, giant mugs of sweet tea and the all you can eat pass arounds. Elena got the chicken and dumplings and I got a ribeye steak. Don't forget to stop by the gift shop and pick up your Lambert's Cafe t-shirts. <laughs> After dinner, we took a little walk together as a family through the Destin Premium Outlets. For more great recommendations about things that you can do in any of the cities across the Panhandle, click this list right here.